SAP to Oracle Cloud Data Migration. In this demonstration, we are going to migrate the data from SAP to Oracle Cloud along with data correction. Log into Chainsys platform with a valid username and password. In this demo, we are going to use a predefined data flow. Data flow defines the flow of data from source to target systems. It is also used to transform the source data as per the target system's data structure. Here the source is the extract that extracts the supplier master data from SAP. Similarly the target is the loader that loads the supplier master data to Oracle Cloud. This is the supplier master data in SAP system. We are going to extract this supplier data and load it into Oracle Cloud application. Before execute the data flow, make sure your source extract is configured accordingly. Similarly, make sure your target loader is configured accordingly. Pre-validations are used to validate the input data before loading them into the target system. It validates the data, collects all the flaws, reports the user with proper error message. You can fix the data errors, validate it again and then load the corrected data into the respective target system. Sample pre-validation that is validating the organization type setup is shown here. The enable pop-up option will show the list of available values to the user during online as well offline data correction. Let's us execute the data flow to initiate the data migration process. Here as you see, the green tick mark shows the 517 records have been extracted successfully from the source. Click on the loader status to view the success and error records. Here only 10 records error out of 517 records. Click on the edit data link to correct the data. Here the first column error messages shows the detailed error message. The tax organization type and the supplier type is invalid. We need to correct this data before loading into Oracle Cloud. Click the pop-up icon and select the appropriate values. This is an online data correction. If all the records were success, this step is not needed. Correct the supplier type column 2. Once the error is corrected, save the data and revalidate the corrected data. In case of larger error records use the offline data correction mode. Download the error records for offline data correction. Now all the corrected data has been validated successfully. Resume the execution. Thus the corrected data is loaded successfully. You can view the loaded data by clicking the record count. The post load reconciliation compares the validated data with the actual target data. The chart shows the record count of loaded and not loaded records. Here all the records are loaded successfully. Now the data is loaded successfully, let's log in and check in the Oracle Cloud application. In this demo, we have migrated the supplier master data. You can also migrate setup and transactional data in the similar way. This complex data migration is achieved with few simple steps and without any coding. As you see, the SAP Supplier Master Data is now available in Oracle Cloud application using DataZap tool. Thank you for watching. <music>